days. I wake up at like 8 probably and I end up just laying in bed for 2 hours. <laughs> My happiest moment of the week was when I woke up at like 5am and realized I had so many more hours to keep sleeping. And that's what I did. I haven't showered in a bit. Um, so I think I'm gonna do that right now. Like I don't smell nasty. Like I always make sure I smell amazing. But I don't feel amazing. I don't feel amazing inside. So, let's go. That was the most refreshing shower of my entire life. I will never be the same again. I'm just putting on a moisturizer because I feel like that's what my skin's been craving lately. Especially since it's starting to get colder outside, which is so freaky. So, what do you expect me to do, weather? My desk is so messy. I can't believe I have just like two cups laying around. At least there's nothing in the cups. That's like an improvement from before. Like I used to have like half drank coffee cups just lying around. We gotta celebrate the little improvements sometimes, you know what I mean? I've been feeling in a bit of a funk for the past two months, honestly. Why can't I just... Okay, you know, good enough. I had one midterm yesterday that I only like kind of studied for and a couple more over the past couple weeks that I've been like kind of studying for but I haven't really been putting my whole heart into it but I don't know if you can't put your whole heart into something like study I mean like you can't but I don't know if I can like I just keep wishing my routine as a whole were different instead of just going to school and like doing the work you know like i just end up wishing my life was just more exciting last night i was journaling and this is an entry that i kind of wish share it is currently october 25 something i've been worried about lately is that i'm losing my intellect because i never really know what to say sometimes anymore it's been making me feel so insignificant because I place so much value on words and wit. And I had a very firm image of myself as someone who is talkative and bubbly and bright and eloquent. But I just haven't been feeling that lately. Instead, I've been feeling simply dull. I think it's because my routine is so school, 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 which I'm not particularly passionate about. There just hasn't been much excitement, but I don't really need excitement to feel like I have a lot going on in my mind. At least I didn't used to. Is this my bad karma moment? Is this my is this my off season? Like whoever's writing my story is in the bathroom doing coke. Cause it's kind of boring lately. I hate like every time I do mascara it's like it always smudges. Do you see? I don't know why that keeps happening to me, but it does. Blushing. I feel like this always makes me look a little bit sunburned, but I kind of like it. I'm not even left-handed. I'm in my closet right now, and I'm so nervous to change because I know it's going to be so cold. Ah! But this is just such a flattering angle. I'm just peeping my head out, like... Why did I do that? I am literally going to run out of potential outfits to wear. Every day that passes, I'm like running out of outfits. I wear this, these pants, not these pants, these pants. Can you believe I have to wear thermals now? This is literally such an unfair twist of events. And then people are like, oh my God, but fall is so cozy, you get to layer up. And I'm like, I don't know how to layer up. And that sounds like a me problem, but guess what? It is a me problem, and I do have a problem with it. Just kidding. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. I'll just wear the damn clothes. The thing about this outfit is I'm worried because it's not even that warm. Like, it's, like, kind of warm, but it's not, like, warm. You know, like, I'm in this room, which is not even the outside, and I'm still a little bit, like, burnt. 
Actually, that's a lie. I'm in this room and it's perfect temperature, but I know when I step outside, it's gonna be like, pfft. so that's my dilemma. But besides that, um, now I'm about to review for my upcoming class because they always post pre lecture videos. And I'm just gonna watch it right now. And that's what I call running away from my problems. <sighs> the thing about blow drying my bangs is it's always a hit or miss. Sometimes they come out too poofy at the end and then other times they come out perfect. But see, too poofy. Mm! I can't. Oh God. I think we're becoming friends on a closer level now because you got to see me in my absolute worst. But Usually when it's poofy, it like calms, it calms down after a little while. Right now I'm bundled up like a little igloo girl, but it's fine. Like my hands are already cold, my face is already cold. Gloves. So, oh my god. <laughs> she brought gloves. I can't even. I am bare handing this, but it's gonna be a worthwhile struggle. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Right now we're on the way to our only class of the day and look at all the fall oh my god my hair I feel like I'm like some kind of character look at all the fall colors behind me it's so cute wait wait Class is over, so now we're just walking around Main Mall because the leaves are gonna turn naked soon. So no, the gotta... trees, not oh, the yeah. leaves. The trees are gonna turn naked soon because all the leaves are gonna fall. So now we're just gonna try to enjoy it while we enjoy still can. Enjoy for sure, because yesterday was raining so and very cold. Today is not so bad, so yes, we're enjoying this moment. Exactly. Of course no. not! Hockey, which used to be an addiction of mine back in first year. <laughs> I'd have it all the time and now I don't really have it very often but now I'm just revisiting my roots. And then Zara said when she was younger, she would pretend that the Pocky was like a pipe. Oh yeah, like Corella de Ville kind of pipe. <laughs> Except not as mean as her. We love dogs. <laughs> oh, yes. back from the walk and I'm so like tired school tires me out so much so I'm just lying here like I was gonna do tasks I was gonna be productive I was gonna study ahead but instead I am simply I was gonna eat I will eat but at the same time like, I don't want to move from this one spot in this moment in time okay so I think I took a nap I don't even know if I took a nap. I was just laying there for so long and now it's 4.30 when I came back at like 3. But I think it's about time to eat something because I'm pretty hungry. So I'm going to... Oh my god, the floor is so cold. Um, I'm going to get a meal prep and just heat it up and have it.
So right now I'm going to make a cover for your own your own kid by Taylor Swift. I need to do something to get out of this weird funk that I've been in. And maybe making a cover is gonna help with that. So I'm gonna do it. I have this set up. I don't think I saw that good in the cover. So there's my little emotional. Oh, oops. <laughs> I don't think I sound that good in the cover. I feel like it's getting harder and harder these days to control my voice. Like I just don't have the energy or motivation to sing well sometimes. And I don't know if that means I should like stop singing or I don't know. I don't know. I'm like bundled up right now and I'm like cold. <laughs> This is the show I would have eaten up when I was eight. It's really bringing back my childhood to me, just watching Barbie right now. <sighs> the weather is finally beginning to be a little bit brutal. It's raining slightly, but I forgot to bring my umbrella. I am braving the weather. I am using my hood, and that's what matters. So I got back from Sashia, and I'm just having a nice cup of hot cocoa. I feel like right now is the perfect temperature for it because it's getting cold. How many times am I going to say that in this video? It is getting cold. We know. Okay. Currently, I'm just laying in bed. Feeling like a little potato. Um, I wish I filmed a little bit more in sectionals, but I was feeling a little bit shy. Just a little bit shy to be like, hey guys, let's vlog today. You know what I mean? Um, how did it go? It went okay. The thing was, I was mostly just on Hinge the entire time. And the thing about Hinge and Tinder and Bumble is that I go on these apps just looking for a good time. And I never end up matching with people who I genuinely want to match with. Like sometimes I'll just be a little bit generous with my, you know, swipe rights. And then later when they match with me, I'm like, mm. you know what I mean? So, especially on Hinge, like, none of the ones I actually want to match with end up matching with me. And I'm like, excuse me, like, what did I do to you? Why are you missing out on such a great opportunity right here? <laughs> but it's their loss. So, yeah. And, um, what else? I think I'm gonna call it a night right here, right now. Oh, I also had pasta. I didn't show you but who cares it's just in my stomach you didn't even need to see me eat that pasta but yeah I think I'm gonna call it a night because I'm tired and I'm cold ah it's like the 10th time I said that in this video but I am tired so I'm gonna go to sleep hope you enjoy my day in the life it's probably like i hope you like the homemade film on an iphone got no budget got no anything kind of vibe yeah hopefully you enjoyed and good night ask about my day i'm tired but you made it seem sweeter please always be nice that way